It's the perfect gift. It's tailor-made for you and no two are alike. What am I talking about? You might receive a DNA kit for the holidays. By 2021, it's expected that 100 million people will have had their genes analyzed by a direct-to-consumer or DTC company. Now, I don't mean to be the holiday Grinch, but I'm going to give you four things to think about before you open what could be a Pandora's box. First, it's important to know that while learning about your possible ancestry or finding new relatives can be fun, you might also find out unexpected information. For example, discovering you have half-siblings you didn't know about will surely raise some questions you might not want to ask. There's a mix of information that you can get from these DTC companies. Some of it's reliable and warrants a discussion with a genetic counselor or your doctor, but much of it can be just plain wrong or misleading. You might think it's cool to find out about your supposed genetic wake-up time, but you might not be prepared to find out about your risk for cancer or Alzheimer's disease. It sounds a lot less exciting, but this holiday season actually talking with your family members about their health history and then sharing it with your doctor can have a more positive effect on your health than a DTC test. Is privacy important to you? You may think you've gotten a great gift, but paying someone to take your DNA and sell it makes you the generous one. So whether you get a DNA kit or decide to give one, remember we are so much more than what's in our genes. If you do choose to dive into the gene pool, tread carefully and reach out to someone like me, a genetic counselor, if you need some help.